Hey, it's me, Samantha Smith, and I'm back with another video. And today we're gonna be talking about feminine hygiene. And I'm gonna be basically discussing two of the favorite products that I've been using for three years now. So let's get right into it. I got two of the bottles of the other products, feminine washes that I would try, and I just, it just wasn't it for me. So I have had the cookie wash. This is a lavender all natural feminine wash as well. So I do like a lot of her other products. Like I've, I have a few of her products. So that's another video for another day. So I'm gonna get into that because I'm very passionate about those products. And those are products that I really use on the regular. Um, I also have the Honey Pot. This one's supposed to be a sensitive um, foaming wash, but I don't know. I don't know, it's just, it's not doing what I need it to okay, be. So this is the Goddess Body Yoni Wash. And OMG, you guys, I love it love love this wash because it just does what it's supposed to do it just makes me feel fresh all day long okay i just feel fresh and if you tried it you would love it too um i love the smell of it it's a mild honey kind of citrus smell and it's not overpowering so you don't have to worry about um it causing any issues or anything like that because i'm very sensitive and this product just works wonders for me okay um i'm just so glad i found this product because it's been a long journey of trying different things that do not work you know it just doesn't do the job um I've had so many other products that I've used. I've tried Summer's Eve, um, Lemmy Soul, um, what else? Sweet Cookie Wash. I've tried that. I've tried the Honey Pot. Let me show All the other products I try, it's normally like a foam type of um, consistency. This has more like a liquidy consistency. I can show you what it looks like um this is how it comes out Let's see okay, you see that it's more like a gel type consistency and it smells like it smells so good oh my goodness um the other ones i've tried it's like foam type Wanna, you know, it's, especially in the summertime, ladies, you know it gets hot and you sweat and you just want to stay fresh all day. This is the product for you, honey. Like the lady who created this, black owned, and I'm so thankful she created this product because I don't know. I don't think I could do anything else but this. And so I pair it. So when I was young I remember asking my aunt like hey are we supposed to lotion down there you know because you know in the winter time it gets a little dry and I'm just like a little dry on the outside you know the skin it's like a little I used to get a little dry baby and I'm just like wait a minute what am I supposed to do so she was like, well, is it a part of your skin? And I'm like, um, yeah. And then she was like, okay then. And I'm just like, okay, but what am I supposed to use? Because I know when I used to go to my doctor, I used to have issues with using different types of soaps and things like that. Because back then we didn't have these options, right? We didn't have these options like that. I mean, they did have summer's eve and stuff like that. I've tried that on Lemmy Soul and all of that. And no, it's just still no good. Like those stuff is still no good for the cat. You know what I'm saying? So, um, <laughs> so, um. So yeah, so she was like, okay then. So I'm like thinking like, okay, what am I supposed to put there? Vaseline, lotion. I know I'm not supposed to put fragrance stuff like that down there. So I'm just like, what did I do? 
So, um, I'm just happy that I came across the Yoni oil, right? Because now I'm like, okay, oh my gosh, where was this product years ago when I used to be like, okay, we don't want to be out here looking crazy with no ashy cookie, right? We don't want no ashy nothing going on down here. You know, you can't really put too much stuff, especially if you're sensitive like me or I'm. I'm sensitive. If you're sensitive like me, you do not want to be putting so much different stuff down there. So yes, the Yoni Oil Baby is it. Um, it keeps you nice and moisturized. Keeps you feeling fresh, smelling fresh. This also gives me like a citrusy, lemony. It's like a lemony smell. Like both products smell really, really good. And it's not an overpowering smell. It's very mild, but all natural. And it's nothing to worry about. Like, oh my goodness, is it gonna cause any problems? If I use this product down there, no baby, no, 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 no. So yeah, I wanted to share these products because I love them. They are my favorite. And yeah, I remember years ago when I used to go to the doctor and I'm like, okay, I know I'm not so, supposed to use certain soap, so what am I supposed to use down there? And they would just say, oh, it cleans itself. And you know, you just need a little water or a little vinegar and that's it. And I'm just like, that's it? Like, um, no, I'm not a doctor or a physician or any of that. But you, if you wanna do that, you can go ahead and do that. But when you sweating, honey, the water and vinegar ain't gonna be it it's just not gonna be it's not gonna be enough so i would just keep her honest with you so um yeah a baby um zoom me a favor and get you some of this and okay so i usually order online but i have a wax center that actually sold this product and i was so surprised when i saw it because i was like omg like i finally found a store like that i can just go purchase and pick it up um so for both products um i don't remember how much it cost on the online website but for both products i i paid like 57 and change for both products together but it does last you a long time a little bit goes a long way you do not have to use a lot of these pro this product for it to do the job so yeah i was so hyped when i found a place that i could just walk in the store and purchase my stuff because i i'm a little impatient when it comes to purchasing online so yeah i don't like having to wait i like to have my stuff right there i found out about these products on YouTube. It was a girl on YouTube three years ago. I was watching a review between the Honey Pot, the Honey Pot wash and the Yoni, the Goddess Yoni Oil wash. I found out about it three years ago through her. I wish I could like, um, you know, like link, like link the video below, but um, I'm not sure if I'll be able to find it. But yeah, it was a girl three years ago who did a review on the products, and I'm glad she did because ever since I've tried this, I have not want to go back. So yeah, I I'm really passionate about these products, so I just wanted to share with you guys. And so next time, bye.